Hey, Phil from BoatRx. I'm on a Lagoon 46 today. This is a recent install from our friends at Thermodynamica here in South Florida. We're in Fort Lauderdale. And I came down to check out this new model of equipment. This is the VRV8 that was just released from Thermodynamica. So similar to the other VRV systems that we've installed in the past, this functions on all the same principles and it's a lot smaller and really powerful and efficient for its size. So I wanted to come see it in, in person and so far I'm really, really impressed. So this is 35,000 BTUs of cooling capacity and it's driving three air handlers, two here in the hall and then one in the salon. And then there's another unit on the port side doing the same thing. So you actually have full redundancy in the salon, 60,000 BTUs of, of air handler capacity in the salon, which is kind of insane, but it's actually not if you consider that we have redundancy and rapid cooling and capacity on demand and all the things that VRV offers for that. So this is running right now. It's also super quiet um, and it's maintaining this boat at 72 degrees. Let's take a look at the power it's using because that's always what everybody wants to know. There's our Victron system. And we're drawing 1700 watts right now. Bear in mind that that includes the refrigerators, the multiple um, drawer refrigerators, the freezer, and in any other appliances that are on the boat right now. Uh, in fact, a moment ago, it was a 1,000 watts, so maybe the hot water heater is kicked on or something like that. Either way, um, it's South Florida in, what's it, July? <laughs> Still July. Uh, so it's about 85 degrees outside right now, and that's uh, really impressive to be cooling the whole boat on 1,800 watts. Uh, and in the customer's own words, uh, before he had the system and had his traditional self-contained units, it, the boat was using about 6,000 watts to cool itself down. So huge power difference there. The RV8, really excited to show it off.